Welcome or welcome back, new viewers and game viewers. It's time for another Paper Mario episode, and today we're going to look for those Yoshi kids because, well, the town is in a muck and uproar over the children being missing, so let us begin finding them. Now that we have Sushi the Cheap Cheap alongside us, there was nothing that could stand in our way, such as these pools of water. So we just give it a nice ride. We can go pretty much anywhere we want. Even under here. And that's one of them Yoshi kids right now. And another super block. Right, let's deal with this man over here. I'm gonna quick hammer so I can... Actually, oh wait, I have power quick, that's right. We can spread around the damage even more. It does five damage, too bad I won't be able to do anything to these guys. Now, if I wasn't running low on FP already, I'd do something, but I guess not. Ow, three damage. And I'm still trying to get the action command right and it's not doing anything. Alright, hammer attack. You stand no chance. I think I got that action command wrong just now, but that's alright. Got at least some hearts back, can't get mad at that. Not at all. And another coin. Alright, that's likely a hurts plant. And we can use our super block. We shall upgrade our newest partner, Sushi. Do you want to upgrade this member? Yes, I do. Sushi's upgraded to Super Rank. Sushi now has one more attack power to remain attack. And she gets a new attack. Is this our hurt plant? Yes, it is. I do want to showcase her new attack. But I'm going to kill at least one of these guys for now. And I'm poisoned. Oof. Alright, water block. Create a block of water to boost Mario's defense briefly. Alright, this is very similar to Watt's turbo charge. And instead of raising attack, it raises his defense. And now he has one extra point of defense for three turns. Definitely a nice defensive tool. In case you uh, are running low on HP or just need to take an attack very deeply. see what's in this tree. Uh, it's probably another one of those bush things. Ah, let's fight him, why not? I can only really take out one of these guys for now. Alright, no, no poison, that's good. Get out of here. I got a few hearts for my troubles. Alright, we need to find at least one of them cute children. Where are they, though? Alright, this flower, if I remember correctly, does some damage to you. All that for a coin, not worth it. Not worth it at all. Alright, those are more of those bush enemies, I don't want to fight them. Let's go this way. Uh-oh. Ow! Ow! That's just rude, man. Thankfully there's a jungle fuzzy there and he won't be able to touch me. 
Kind of hope see mold supplies, not gonna lie. Just so I can get more experience as usual. Oh, thank you. Asking you shall receive, they say. Can't touch me. <laughs> I don't know why this is here. Oh, that's why it's here. It's like a dam. Not that type of dam, the actual bridge of a dam. Uh-oh. Uh, that's a that's a garbage placement for one of those. I probably kinda want to just power quick. I might have to drink some honey syrup later, but thankfully there's a store in town that sells them. Earthquake! Keep getting the action command wrong. So annoying. Alright, that's fine. Goodbye. I think these guys should be considered spiked enemies, too. I mean, just look at their teeth. This jungle fuzzy don't know what he's messing with. Alright, well, obviously the shy guy is the thing I'm the most worried about. Too bad I won't be able to hit him. How am I getting this action command wrong so many times? Might have to go back to town for a bit to go get recovered. Alright, going ahead, the more the merrier, they say. the matter? You can't touch me. Ha <laughs> ha. Alright, we could go over here. Or let's go over here. What do we have? <laughs> Somebody help me! I'm so scared I want to go home. Ah, that kid had it coming from. Let me eat a mushroom first. Alright, I'm gonna bring Goombario out. Why are they dancing like that? Trying to assert their dominance or something. But anyways, this is a different type of prana plant, not like the ones we saw in the Forever Forest. This is a future prana. Max HP 12, attack power 3, defense power 0. Future piranha plants sometimes bite, but the truly scary thing is their nasty, poisonous breath. The power of the bad breath is too, but your HP will begin to fall if you get poisoned. You should try to recover as quickly as possible if you get poisoned. Poisonous breath, I say. Sounds like you need to brush your teeth, huh? Ah! Nasty. I can at least get rid of the one in the front. Adios, mate. And this is the part of the game where the enemies noticeably have very high HP pools. Man, I just ate that super mushroom, too. I'm already dying over here. I know a badge that would definitely make the poison status effect not be much of a problem, but we don't have it, and I don't want to go back to uh, Shooting Star Summit to get it. Yeah, that should be a hint on where it is. Alright, now go home, kid. Uh, what? 
Are they all gone? I thought those things were going to eat me right up. Thanks for saving me, Mario. I'll do what you grown-ups tell me to do from now on. I don't even want to do bad things anymore. I just want to be a good boy. I'm going home now. Bye. He wants to be a good boy, he says. All right, then. He's real bad at being a good boy. I'll tell him that much. All right, well, there's no reason to be here anymore. Now let's get over here. Let's see what else we'll find. And I can go over here. Now let's get on over here. Now there's a certain something we have to put in there, if I remember correctly, but we don't have that. Let's go over here. <sighs> wake up! Time to wake up, kid! Oh. The wrong tree. Oh, that's fine, these guys can't touch me. Hey, a little extra experience, nothing wrong with that. Get up, kid. Time to wake up. Ah! Morning. Hey, it's Mario. What's the matter with you? You're looking for me? Oh, sushi too. We were playing hide and seek, and I got real sleepy. I figured I'd nap a uh, trick nap here. There's nothing to worry about. The jungle's not so bad. I'm starting to get a little bit lonely, though, so maybe I ought to head back home. I know. Mm-hmm. That's totally why you're heading back home. Really? Well, quit your lying, kiddo. I don't like your attitude, kiddo. Anyways. But now we're right back over here, finding the rest of those children should be a little bit easier. I'm gonna go take a nap at the end and buy another super mushroom real fast if y'all don't mind me. Because we're gonna need it if we're gonna keep fighting these enemies. Alright, this bed does not look the most comfortable, but we have no choice. Perhaps I'm gonna go back this way and see what else we can find. Actually, we can just go that way. Some extra coins is nice. All <laughs> oh, those damn Yoshi kids crying. Oh, there's something over here. Jump over here, and it looks like there's something hiding. What is that? Oh, it's a stopwatch. I don't need that. Stopwatch is sick. I clearly I wasn't supposed to go this way. I guess I have no choice but to fight this guy over here. 
Oh, there's four of them. The power of the stars will have to guide us here. I call upon the Scholar from high above. I summon thee. Come forth, Scholar. I kind of wish I had a... Uh, what's his face out? Cooper boy, but I'm afraid we can't do that. So I have no choice but to just take one of them out and take all those hits. Actually, yeah, Zaptap will take care of him. Though I'm poisoned now. Actually, it won't even matter. Yeah, that's where you were hiding. I that was so scary. That was so scary. We were playing hide and seek, and that was this weird plan, and it trapped me here. Sushi, you're right. This jungle really is dangerous. This jungle is really dangerous. I'm sorry that I disobeyed you. Thank you for coming to get me. I'm going home now. Actually, I'm gonna see what this, what's in that tree. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. It was a waste of time. Go up here. Well, if I remember correctly, we're supposed to go up there somehow. I don't need that. Kind of hate it when I get these random items when I already have a full inventory. Can go up here. Fly, Mario. Probably going to have to take on that uh, shy guy there. Hello, Aaron. How are you doing today? Uh oh. Uh oh. Everything's going just fine. All right. So I'm going to take out Mr. Shy Guy over here, the spear guy. The rest of these guys are meaningless. I'm just too strong, you can't hurt me. Alright. If Moral Jack is live, that's nice. Oh, he says hi. But anyways, you guys can't hurt me. Do your worst. Just let us know that you're doing very good. Alright, he's multiplying. That's just nasty. Alright, I can take you out right here. Enjoy yourself playing Legend of Zarkis. I'm too busy trying to find Yoshi kids right now. I always said I didn't like babysitting, and here I am babysitting. Alright, that's five. All right, we go into this pipe. I uh, guess we gotta use Wadi Girl. Illuminate the dark. I don't want to use that. Thank you. All right, there's nothing else down here but that. Little boy, go home. There was this flower that spun around, and I thought it was way cool, so I got on it. Then, and then I spun around and around, and then I was up in the air and flying, and then I ended up here. I didn't know how I got here. It was so dark and scary, and I couldn't find a way out. Thank you for coming to get me out of here. I can see how to get out now, so I'm going straight home. You better go home, kid. It is not safe here. I wonder why this boulder's here. Too bad I can't literally cannot do anything with it. Magneton in the past, to make that make sense. Whatevs. Do 
know, spring shoots you back out, I'm gonna need to do some surfing. Yeah, that's right, surfing. There are HMs in this game. Alright, oh my... I got flanked. Oh, uh, what is he going to do? He does nothing. Now, finding that last Yoshi could sometimes gets a little annoying. I just go to the side here. Uh-oh. I'm far too fast for him. How would you get up there? I don't remember how you're supposed to do that. I'm trying to avoid the spear guy over here. Very wind of all things. Weird. Let's see where that last Yoshi kid is. I just found this one to be a little annoying myself in the past. Pretty sure there's a space down here I can go to. No, there isn't. Eh, just get back up here. Seriously, that placement is very awesome. Right, I think I need some sort of statue to move that out of the way, if I remember correctly. Right, let's scour this area one last time just to make sure, but other than that... So I always forget where the last Yoshi kid is. There's five of them, and I've only found four of them so far. Oh. That makes this easier. There we go, here's the last one. Uh, huh? Why? We were playing hide and seek, and I had to be it. But I couldn't find anyone at all. I was wandering around, and then I got lost. You were right, Sushi. The jungle's really scary. Thanks for coming all the way out here to look for me. I'll be good. I'll be a good boy from now on, and listen to you. Mario, will you be it for hide and seek instead of me? I'm going home now. Haha. <laughs> I'm gonna be it! This is probably what he's so happy about. Alright, nothing in there. Oh, jungle fuzzy, I'll fight it. I know these guys literally can't do anything to me. Just spread around the damage, I'd say. He's dead. Alright, I see, so the rest of their movesets is just you trying to use all that. Like, I don't have the patience to do all that in Legends Arceus, and I never did it. I just did what I had to do to at least get to the Arceus boss fight, haven't done anything since. And unless I need a specific Pokémon for competitive play, that's the only time I ever go back to Legends Arceus. I pretty much have no reason to do that. Yes, they are all way stronger than Fairy Wind. I got that little star piece. Alright, now we're gonna go back to the Yoshi village. Because we did what we needed to do here.
Uh, maybe it is easier to do than in BDSP, but eh, it's just too time consuming for my liking. I got other games to make and play, man. I don't have all that time on me. Right, I think that's where that one batch was. There's no reason for us to go up there. I don't know, that isn't where the batch was. That's where the super block was. Alright, the town is no longer in an uproar. And the Elder should be back there somewhere, and here's this guy. Mario, old man. I'm the old man, okay. The village leader was just looking for you. I'd say he wants to say thank you. Better hurry, hmm? He might just tell you where the treasure is from if he's feeling thankful enough. Uh, I know where the Elder is. There he is. Especially since it's a Gen 4 game, yeah. Uh, Mario, I, I must thank you. You have saved the children of the village. I feel that no expression of uh, gratitude could be enough. You truly are a hero. We deeply appreciate your valor. At least I can do this. You still wish to go to Mount Lava Lava, don't you? I have remembered a good way to reach the volcano. Please come this way. All right, this, that, that looks weird. What is he doing? That, you know, don't answer that. I don't want to know what he's doing. That doesn't look right. Huh. I thought it was somewhere around here. Bro, can you stop? That just looks weird. Oh, yes, I found it. Here it is. Take it, please. I don't want to take anything. Whatever. You got the Jade Raven. The Jade statue of a raven that uh, Yoshi's Village Leader gave you. Whatever events beyond our control occur on this island, we ask help of Raphael the Raven, the island's master. If anyone can help you reach the volcano, it's definitely Raphael the Raven. He lives in the depths of this island. If you place that jade uh, raven in the statue of Raphael, the way into the depths of the jungle will appear. I haven't been uh, to see Raphael since I was but a young Yoshi. I remember that it was incredibly difficult to find him because the jungle trees and shrubs covered the way. I'm sure you'll find the path. May all your wishes come true. Wait just one minute. You must have one heck of a story behind you, Mario. Why in the world would you want to go to Mount Lava Lava? It's very hot and very dangerous in the volcano. If you aren't extremely careful and lucky, you'll be roasted to a golden brown. But you don't care. You guys are going there anyway. And I do not approve of this. Man, I don't need your permission to go up there. Who are you talking to like that? Uh-huh. Oh. Oh. You're going to the volcano because you want to save the princess from some bad guys? What a touching story. Romantic stories like that just touch a soft spot in this heart of mine. That does it. I can't let you go alone. I assume she will be by your side until the end. You needn't worry, Mario. I love taking care of others. If you plan on getting through this jungle, you need me anyway. Come, Mario. That volcano isn't getting any cooler. You know one thing about sushi? Why is her name Sushi? Do you realize how cruel that is? Fish is being named Sushi. That's like naming a cow burger. Mm, there's a certain franchise I know that did that. Or a chicken, like, nugget or something. It's just not right. It's just cruel, man. Anyways, how much HP do I have? Now let's do a quick rest. Alright, second app, and then we'll go put that jade statue where it belongs. Go this away. Oh, there's a star piece over there. It looks like I have yet to get. Yeah, we can always get that another time. That's fine. I might have just gone the wrong way just now. You're right about that. Who cares if they don't approve? And besides, you don't need her permission to do that. Alright, I could just... Ah, I could've just went this way. I'm being slow. Like, 
right, we got things to do, man. We gotta beat up Bowser and there's other people. Now, you know what? I can mention that little uh, fun fact at the end of the game. Because there's something I forgot to mention about this game in regards to Mario RPG, but I'm not gonna get into that right now. Alright, the Jade Raven. Yeah, the statue moved. I'll take it. Ignore a spear guy over here for a second. Move the bushes out the way. Now we got ourselves a block over here. There's little spots over here you can put the blocks over. I think that's a hint that there might be something under them. Or above them? Actually, oh, I remember what this is. They're little geysers. Just gotta plug up all the holes. And it's right there, and there you go. Let me plug this one up just in case one goes over here. Now, right, where'd it go now? It's over there. All right, now that moves that out of the way. Uh, I think so, yeah, because those are the only two types that are weak to electric, so it makes sense for that to be the only one. And right, move that block over here, out of the way. All right, there doesn't seem to be much over here, other than these vines I think I need to grab on. I mean, I'm just gonna eat that mushroom right away, it doesn't matter. Eat it! Alright, super mushroom. Gotta tug on these vines, and there's our secret path. <laughs> Something's up ahead. Uh oh. What do we have here? I might use uh, Bombette. Try to blow him up. These men picking a fight with us. They won't get far. And there's a white magic Koopa. Why is that there? Dang it, now I wish I had Goombario in the front. So I want to scan that. You know what? Can we just do that another time? They do show up later in the game. Eh, I don't really care. I call upon the Scholar of the Skies. Summon thee. Come forth, Scholar. I'm gonna switch partners for now. Ah, screw it. Let's just take some damage. I can do a uh, quick hammer next turn. Ah, that's exactly why I wish I had Goombario in the front from the start. Uh oh. Oh, fuck out of here. That's garbage. Anyways, do your tattle. This is a white magic Koopa. This is one of the magicians of the Koopa clan. White robes, huh? How does he keep them clean? Also, that's racist. Max HP 11, attack power 3, defense power 0. He's a healer. When the mag magical heals, when he magically heals one companion, it recovers 5 HP. And when he heals all of his companions at once, they all recover 3. He better take care of this guy, but fast. I'm just gonna use Scholar again, screw it. I call upon the Scholar of the Skies. Come forth, Scholar. You quit using your breath on me, that's just nasty. Alright, we could just hit him normally and we win. Used up a lot of resources to do that, I'm not the biggest fan. No, I'm not talking about the white clothes, I mean him being a white magic Koopa. <laughs> Let me stop. <laughs> Let me stop. Let's get all the coins, hopefully there's a heart block around here. I don't want to go heal unless there is, in case there isn't. Alright, we got ourselves a magical tree.
All right. We go inside, and there's a save block. I think we can come up here for a sec, right? Because the magical Raphael the Raven happens to be up here. It's a long way up. Ooh, a new badge. Now uh, you got the happy heart. Restores HP automatically during battle at a slow rate. I think that recovers one HP like every turn or something. I'm not entirely I don't entirely remember. It looks like we're at the top of the tree now. Alright, here is Raphael the Raven. We will have to talk to him, but I'm afraid we'll have to- uh-oh. Uh oh Ah, oh, we're fine. Alright, that is Raphael the Raven, but we will talk to him in the next episode. So why don't we hit the save block right over here, and do our outro, and make a safe save real quick as well. Anyways, if y'all enjoyed this edition of the Paper Mario playthrough and you want to see more, leave a like. Or please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and follow. Hit one of the vids you see on screen right now if on YouTube, and that bell button for more. May I give a special thank you to Aaron for joining me once again for this wondrous episode. Video sponsored by the wonderful Peeps at W. Just hit the link in the description below. Use the code provided to get a wonderful discount on your wonderful energy recorder. I recommend the Dragon Egg flavor. And what did you like and dislike about this video? We can make the, use that feedback to make future videos even better. Yeah, somewhere there's no Silver Trainers in Paldea, so let's do our little raid. Let's see who happens to be live, and that'll be the end of this episode. Alright, let's do Kimura. I'm gonna raid him. Give him your love and support. Just give it a few seconds, and that'll be it. Alright, thank you everybody for watching, and have a very day.